Hi, welcome to SBR Sports Picks. I'm Peter Lozak. He's Mike Brander. We are the Odds Couple. We come to you from sportsbookreview.com. It's uh, week seven in the NFL. We're going to take a look now at the Sunday night game. Now, Mike Brander, there's a lot of picks that uh, we're both liking this week in the NFL. We've given them out in videos officially. This game is not one that we've discussed much yeah. and not one that I, I, I'm not, I, as far as it yeah. right now, as we sit here Friday it's afternoon, pole. it's a 10-foot pole for yeah. me. It's Seattle at Arizona. Now, Arizona, Great game last week, and for most of the week, that was a total 10-foot pole game for us. But mm-hmm. then on Monday, you did your research, you decided and realized that Arizona was going to be a good bet that night, and they absolutely were. There's still, though, a team with flaws, yes. right? Still yeah. a team with flaws, and there's there's new uh, injury concerns with Carson Palmer. Not yep. serious ones, not a concussion. This one is, I think, a pulled hamstring. The point is, you know, he's getting up there in age. Yep. He's got injury concerns, and yep. he's a big part of the problem. And then on the other side, you have Seattle, which is also a team that, that has some major strengths, but also they always have that... Offensive, offensive line, line issue. You week, always talk about that. Every week, yeah. that's an issue. And guess what? And this is the truth, right? Russell Wilson is banged up. He is mm-hmm. nowhere near near 100% mobile. He is, right. and uh, uh, even I think it was Brady Quinn. I was watching mm-hmm. one of his shows. All right, he, this guy's like 60 to 65 percent, and that's it. And if he is limited in what yeah. he does, yeah. that's a huge weapon to lose. But. Look on the other side of the ball. You got a guy that's probably taking Geritol pretty soon, Carson <laughs> yeah. Palmer, for real, and he's banged up. So I don't see him putting consistent week to weeks together. But then again, you got two of the best coaches in football. I love both right. these guys, Pete Carroll and Bruce Arians. So Arizona was able to take advantage of a, of, of a weak team and give a little boost to their uh, year last week against the Jets. Right now, if they can do that again, you can get minus one at Pinnacle. It's minus two at the Chris Book. So it's between minus one and minus two market wide. What do you think? Do you think that Arizona might be worth a shot? I don't know. I can't. The do total. It. Is very low. It's 43. I would actually lean over on that one just because at some point, you know, know. the I, offenses can pick it up. I mean, you know, the, these Sunday night games in Arizona with low well, totals. There's, one, you, there's one thing that is happening right mm-hmm. now for Seattle, and that's Jimmy Graham's finally paying some dues. Mm-hmm. I mean, paying some benefits from that, that trade years ago. But uh, he's a big part of what they're going to do. And without Russell Wilson being mobile, all right, look for some little, you know, 10 and outs, 5 and outs, mm-hmm. him going across mm-hmm. the middle. That's what they're going to do, and they're going to try to pound that running game. Arizona's defense, I don't know, man. I'm just not sold on this team. Pete, this is an easy one one for me to say the smartest bet is no bet. Is no bet, right. Uh, if you had to have a lean, if I had to have a lean on this you one, I just want to get something. No, no, well, no, you know, I, we got we to give our viewers some kind of lean. This is not an official play, but if I had to have a lean, I would give a lean towards Arizona have to have at minus That's what I'm telling you. You, don't, you have don't, have have don't have to have a lean. No one's got I would, a gun I would, to I would, I would have. I would have a slight lean on Arizona being able to get it done okay. again, second week in a row at home against yeah. another team that can be beat. I mean, Bruce yeah. Arians, you know, he motivates these teams. and you Last week he did. And so are you telling me that he's going to be like, okay, guys, nice game against the Jets. Who cares about this? This game Not at all. Yeah, no, Bruce Arians, get but guess what? Bruce Arians can't pass the ball or hand it off. And, he, and right. guess what? Right now, with Palmer hurting, all right, he finally showed some flashes of who he was. Right. And Drew Stanton already proved he's not the answer. Mm-hmm. So there's only so much Arians can do to pump up a team yeah. with emotion and sure, momentum. Sure. But you got to do it on the field. Stay the hell away from it, yeah. Pete. I can't right. let you go down like that. I'm staying away from it. I haven't bet it yet. But uh, just for the sake of argument, just for the sake of discussion, if I had to give a lean on it right now, I would give Arizona yeah. minus oh, one. got to give something. Hey, do we, are we going head to head this week at all? Uh, no. no. We're no. actually uh, going. Uh, going We're on the same train. Mano, Mano, E Mano, Mano, yeah, man, with Man on a couple of picks with Doug Upstone. So that's yes. a good position. Yeah, yeah. well, Doug, he, he said going, he's going yeah. to drive to the bank. So, and Doug drives pretty well. All right. Nice job, Mike Brenner. We'll see you all on Monday for the Monday opening line show for NFL Week yes, 8. We will. Can't wait. Research before you bet. Be sure to check out SBR Picks for the best game predictions, breakdowns, and much, much more. 